Swoosh. Ciao. Hey everybody, it's Gameragi. We are heading this way towards the river, hopefully. Nope. Looks like another room of birds. Oh my god, this room is enormous. Oh god, intimidation. It's in the sunlight though, that's always good. Hmm. 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 Well, obviously I can't do anything standing around. Oh, the, I can see the treasure chest on my map. It's up high though, I can't get to it yet. So... Box to that. I've been watching way too much Yogg's cast. <laughs> I'm just gonna pick up their, their little phrases. What's over here? Nothing? Nope. Okay, looking good. Looking pretty good. Uh, uh that would be pretty cool. What the heck? Why am I supposed to. What? What am I supposed to do? Oh, maybe I can grab the pipe? Yeah, no. Oh, I have a feeling I'm actually supposed to be in here. Uh, feeling lost. My feeling was lost. How am I... what? Am I oblivious? Am I oblivious? No, I'm Gameragi. <laughs> Haven't you been watching? God. Hey, I'll touch you. Maybe I can actually hop up here? Oh. Oh my god. I'm having serious troubles right now, friends. Uh, so I gotta go up there. But to get up there, I gotta go over here. To get over there, I gotta go... I mean, there's another un underwater tunnel I just completely glazed over with my eyes. The colors underwater are a little confusing. This music's really epic for how little is happening right now. <laughs> hello. Hello, hello, here we go. What? Oh, jeez, war, come on. Jump, jump in a, jump in a logical direction, would you? Would you please? Would you kindly? Thank you. <laughs> All right. So the chest I want is up, up chair. But to get up chair, I'm gonna go over chair. Up chair, over chair, up chair, over chair, up chair, over chair. Jump. Slammy fist. Oh, wait, oh, hold on, more water? That I did not foresee. I did not foresee. But now I'm here. I'm. I'm looking good here. This makes it easy. Makes it so easy. What? Why would you do that? Why would you do that? War, come on. You like you, you you like Mr. Jump Jump from Mr. Jump Jump game. Is that a game? I don't. Know. Is this another Wrath Shard? Yeah, this is the third one I've gotten recently. It's crazy. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Uh, now I can go over here. Yeah. Yeah. What do you say? Health. I don't need it. I don't need it. Slam me fast. I mean, I mean, stop it. Stop it. Stop it, you zealots. Is that what Woody says in Toy Story? Zealots or something? Zealots? Maybe it's zealots. <laughs> stop it, stop it, you zealots. That's a crazy worshipping. Little aliens, you know, you know, what I'm, you know what I'm talking about. First Toy Story. 
I hope you do, because Toy Story is an amazing movie, and if you haven't seen it, you've probably seen Toy Story 3. And if you saw that before you saw the first Toy Story, I, I pity you. I, I shoot pity rays at you with my pity, pity gaze. Just a bunch of, a bunch of pity going. Okay, water slide, Whee! La la la. This looks boss-like in nature. Don't ask me why it looks boss-like in nature. You see this? This is where an angel was once dead, and now he's not there. Which means something ate him. And if something eats an angel, typically a boss, you know. I would assume. There he is. That's Beaver. With his crystal belly. So, I imagine we're going to do some exciting crystal shattering in this episode. Oh, oh, not good! Laser beam! Oh, I can use the ice to block his laser beam. But, it superheats the ice. No, I don't even think this is ice anymore. It superheats it so I can't smash it. So I have to distract him. Oh! Until it melts, or until his laser runs out. Quite honest, that's actually a better idea. Whoa, God! Bless America! Okay. Slammy Fist, go! Slammy Fist, go! Yeah, okay, now we're looking good. Dodge! Dive, duck, dive, dodge, 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 dive, duck. Throw a wrench. Can't hit me behind this, can ya? Whoa, Super Slam Fist! <laughs> He knocked it back! Hey, you joik! I'm watching you, butt boy. I wanna slash him. Punch him. Punch him in the crystal. Yeah! Okay, now. <laughs> Where's your protective cluster now, Reba? His head is a giant horn. Full of insects. He's a giant hive! Whoa. That is mysterious. Mysterious and spooky. And all together ooky. I'm singing an Adam's Family song because it fits in this situation. Dang it. At least these things give you health. You know what I'm saying? All right, here we go. Super slam! Oh, we got back up. Who's gonna slam? You want another one? Is that is that what you ordered? Because I definitely just delivered it. So sorry. What am I doing? Slash! I'm gonna run away. Oh. Yeah, yeah. We know your head is a giant hive full of green creatures. God, that's so disturbing. Does that mean he has no brain? Because I think that might mean he has no brain. I mean, he's got to have all space for all these little creatures, right? He got to have somewhere to live, somewhere to go to school, somewhere to. You know, conduct politics. Little little bat creature politics. Okay, so you gotta hit him twice with this. Cool, cool. We'll do it again. Let's do it again! Oh, st stalactites homing on me. Not cool, not cool. I should probably be running around during this phase, but I'm not. Holy smokes! I'm gonna be done with this. <laughs> I don't know. There, I hit it anyway. Whoa. Missed me. Whoa. Sorry. 
You like trains, do you? There you go. Oh my god. Oh my... Oh! I think you, I think you got him, War. I think you did. Uh, War. Oh! Yes. Woo! I'm all for brutality, but holy smokes! We got a whole life stone, yeah! And the heart of the chosen, yep. Hey, a portal back to the entrance. Where have I seen this before? Two down. Wait a minute. Check my map. Let me check my map. Uh so I guess I got all the treasures other than the very entrance. Which is alarming. At least they're easy to get to, right? Am I right? I think that's the entrance. Oh god. Oh good. Then the real fun begins. All right. So now, we just kicked the, the Reaver's butt, Kyle. like literally, with a train. So all you naysayers are like, "You train pushing is so stupid." Look what we just did with this, huh? We'll never look at trains the same again. Hey, it's Ulthane. How you doing, buddy? Oh, welcome back, Come horseman. Pick it up. You could have knocked, but I suppose that isn't your ways. No way, man. Why are you here? Strange question, seeing as how you're the one broke into my house. You weren't always the Black Hammer. You huddle in exile, a hermit among tombstones. Why? What role did you play in this, Ulthane? Horseman, I've got something for you. A fair bit of work, but uh, it's a bit dainty for me. It'll serve you better. Oh, yeah. You didn't answer my question, old one. Maybe I like the scenery, was it to you? You asked for my help and I gave it. You go on being ungrateful and I'm liable to get upset. Do I look like I'm afraid of death, boy? Don't kill him. It's not death you should fear. What is it? A beautifully crafted pistol that decimates foes with an unending supply of supernatural rounds. Ah, oh, yeah. Unending gun supply. I like how it has shells. <laughs> If it has an unending ammo supply, why does it need shells? Alrighty. I'm gonna look around in Ulthane's little pad here. Wow, an invisible wall. First one I've encountered that didn't make sense. That's okay though. <laughs> so it's got uh, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool digs you got here, man. Hey, hey, talk to him. Scurry away, guy. Scurry away? Who do you think I am? Cockroach? Something that... And you, Wolfane. You're such a delight. Hey, he's so cool. How did War manage to pick up that hammer? Oh, he did get this glove. Maybe that's how he did it. Alright, we're back in the clearing. We can open these doors now that we have this glove. 
probably unlock some secrets. I don't know. Where am I? <laughs> I don't... Endless Ford, I remember that name. Can I go in here? Searching for secrets, as always. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Right. Back to Samael, that's what that You've means. I'm gonna buy some stuff really quick, just so I don't forget. Old Voldem's got something new for Old Voldem's got something new for Oh, now we can buy freaking combos for the glove, too. Oh, my heavens. A leaping ground pound that will send multiple enemies flying. Let's see what we got in here first. Augments the amount of damage inflicted by Mercy. If I remember right, this gun really isn't that great. I mean, for aerial enemies, it might be pretty good. Hmm. All right. Well, we'll get we'll get impact rounds. I'm, I'm feeling adventurous today. And we're gonna get a freaking life crystal. Because, God, some of those times I probably would have died. Woulda, coulda, shoulda, did, didna. I'm gonna assign it to up. What is this assigned to? Nothing? Put it there. Might as well. Okay. What a confusing system. <laughs> Up does crossblade. Left does horn. Down changes between scythe and fist. Ugh. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I got a port. Yeah, I forgot. Samael. Oops. We are coming to you right now. And once we get to him and go through that little cutscene or whatever, I'm gonna end this episode. This might be extremely long, again, because I'm not keeping track of time, but who cares. If you like watching this, then you'll watch it. If you don't like watching it, you probably already skipped to the end and you're hearing me say this sentence. Or you just skip right past the sentence and... It doesn't matter. Oh, that was a short one. Cool. I think every time you beat a dungeon, more powerful enemies are going to spawn here, so you're going to be on your toes. Your tiptoes. At the moment, they're the same freaking enemies. And I don't know why I just used my wrath power on that guy, but it doesn't matter. Actually, it does, because that was my last wrath. The last of me wrath. Kick, 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 kick. Sam, I yell. How are you today, my friend? You giant red man. Did you enjoy yourself? War in the Black Hammer, plucking pigeons. <laughs> you see a great many things from inside a prison, Sam, I yell. There is little you can keep from me, horseman. Once I have a mind to know it. And what do you know of Uriel? <laughs> ah, I thought the horsemen were above such earthly pursuits. She believes I killed Abaddon. The Hellguard worshipped their fallen lord and leader. And Uriel? 
Some might say her admiration was less than professional. <laughs> she will stop at nothing to punish the one responsible. I fought the demon who killed Abaddon, and he will be punished. Straga is the strongest of the Chosen. No doubt you'll face him again. He draws power from the Spire and won't stand to be away from it for long. With all I have taught you, you might even survive the reunion. Whose heart would you have, demon? The Stygian is king of the ancient worms that now plague the Ashlands. It won't be easy. The worms grow well in such fertile ground. Fertile? Fertile with death, decay. All the land is covered in it. The ashes of the dead. But you may be in luck. It seems that some fool demons have taken to capturing the worms for sport, and they hunt other creatures as well. The strongest are made to fight in cruel arenas. The demons seek to tame the Stygian, not knowing that within the monster there beats the black heart of the Chosen. How do the demons avoid the Ashworms? You know of the Chronospheres? A gift of the Old Ones. It is said that to master the Chronosphere is to master time itself. One could stop time, or even move it forward and back. Indeed. None of the Old Masters exist, but the demons have learned to use them to a lesser degree. I can grant you a basic understanding of the Chronospheres. It won't be much. Perhaps just enough to avoid the worms. Perhaps. Perhaps not. What in this life is certain, Horseman? Other than our word, of course. Okay, wow, that was a mouthful. So, alright, we got the ability to Chronomancer. War can now activate chronospheres and temporarily slow down time. That's going to be really useful for the next area we're going to, which is the Ashlands. And, uh, yeah. Talked about some other stuff, which I'm sure you all understood. Clearly, plain as day, you know, sort of. I'm going to have to watch it again. Anyway. This episode's probably way too long, so I'm gonna stop it here, and in the next episode, we're gonna head towards the Ashlands. Alrighty, see you guys next time.